What is up YouTube, program 5 here. Welcome back to another video here on the channel. Today's video, I'm bringing you guys an updated video on how to do the blueprint glitch here in Cold War. So if you guys do enjoy this video, go ahead and drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and do enjoy. Follow King Alpha on his socials. So if you guys do want to stay up to date when he goes live, uploads a video, that'll be down in the description, as well as a link to his Discord if you guys do want to be part of the Z Army gang. And let's get right to the video. So you guys will need a friend for this glitch. So when you have someone you just want to join his multiplayer lobby, then you guys want to go to create a class. Now you need to put an assault rifle in the secondary slot. So you guys need to equip the lawbreaker card. So where you can put assault rifles in the secondary slot. Now you guys want to do is go into the secondary slot, select the assault rifle, and put a blueprint on that gun. Then you guys want to go ahead and back out to the edit class screen. Now that you're back on edit class screen, you guys want to go ahead and pull up your social menu. Now this part is what's different from the last video I made. Last video, you'd go to camos, equip the camo, and then go into social menu, but they patched that part. You can't go into social menu in the camo section anymore. So this is a workaround. We have to go back to the edit class screen and then go into your social menu. Now your friend's going to back out with the party to the main menu and then go into zombies. Now that you're in zombies, your friend can go ahead and leave. Now what you guys want to do is go back out of the social menu. You guys want to go to the camo section for the gun that's in the secondary class. And then you guys want to throw on a camo and you guys will see the gun will disappear. Now what you want to do is go back and change that gun in the secondary class with another gun. As you can see, I'm swapping my gun with the M16, and then you want to click it, and then you want to put on the regular version, no blueprints on it or anything, the regular version. And as you guys can see, we'll put a random blueprint on that gun. Now what you guys want to do is go to Gunsmith, and you guys want to throw on all the attachments that go with that blueprint. Now the blueprint I got with the M16, there weren't really any attachments that went with the gun. So whenever you throw on all the attachments that go on with that blueprint, you guys want to back out, go back in the Gunsmith, then you guys want to save the blueprint as a new mod. Whenever you save it, the blueprint is yours. You guys can use it on that gun anytime you want. Now, since the M16 didn't have much attachments with the blueprints, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys another gun. Now, as you guys see here, I'm putting the AK in the secondary slot with the weapon one blueprint here that I have. I'm going to go ahead and throw on the camo, then the gun is going to disappear. Then I'm going to go ahead back into the secondary slot. I'm going to go ahead and replace that gun with the Krig 6, and it's going to be the regular variant. As you guys can see here, it puts on a blueprint for that gun. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and go through the attachments and just find all the attachments that go on for that gun. You can see here the muzzle, and it puts on like a silencer. So I'm just gonna go over and change everything to where everything matches up with that blueprint. So after putting on all the attachments, this is the final product here for the blueprint on this gun. I gotta say, this blueprint looks fire. I wasn't sure about it when I first saw it, but after putting on all the attachments with it, I gotta say this blueprint is freaking fire. Now I'm gonna go ahead and back out, go back into Gunsmith, and then I'm gonna go ahead and save this blueprint as a mod. And whenever I save it, that blueprint is mine, I can go ahead and use it whenever I want. I'm just gonna show you guys that it does work. You guys can use these blueprints, so just loading the D machine here. Now obviously you guys wanna select the class that has that weapon on it. Now when you first load in, the weapon won't have the blueprint, so you guys have to do, you guys have to go to pause menu and you have to apply the blueprint and go to custom mod area and then select that blueprint, as you guys can see here. I get that blueprint that I saved, and then you guys are free to go ahead and use that blueprint in your game. This is where we're going to end the video. If you guys didn't enjoy, go ahead and drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and do enjoy. Follow King off on all his socials. That will be down in the description if you guys do want to stay up to date to when he goes live, uploads his video, as well as a link to a Discord if you guys do want to be part of the Z Army gang. And until next time, I will see you all later. Peace out.